de la police, qu'aucune intimidation ne pourra passer. Il s'y essaie depuis très longtemps, mais s'il n'a pas encore compris que nous ne sommes pas des gens intimidables, c'est qu'il est loin d'être au niveau d'intelligence que nous pensions. Au-delà, ces instruments vont appeler à des réactions des populations. Ça, c'est inévitable. J'y reviendrai certainement. Nous vous avons convié pour parler probable, probable, principalement de deux séries de problèmes. Le premier est lié aux farces judiciaires en cours, avec un enchaînement inédit que jamais on a vu au Sénégal et peut-être nulle part dans un pays qui se réclame démocratique. Et la seconde série est liée à ce débat, s'il en est, sur le dialogue national. Senegalese prosecutor is now calling for a 10-year jail term against the opposition leader Osimani Sonko on a rape case that has sparked tensions in a West African country. Highly popular among young people, Sonko has branded the trial a political plot aimed at scuttling his bid for the 2024 presidency. The trial was adjourned early Wednesday with a decision expected to be handed down on June 1st, according to the president of the criminal court after the latest hearing lasted into the early hours of Wednesday. The trial resumed Tuesday after the court rejected pleas by Sonko and his co-accused for an adjournment after he failed for a second time running to attend legal shutdown. Sonko has been charged with rape and making death threats against an employee of a beauty salon in Dakar. Sonko, 48 years, has said he went to the salon for a massage for chronic back pain and denies any assault. Complainant at G. Sal maintained her accusations in Tuesday's hearing, saying she had been abused five times by Sonko. She also said she had received death threats. Sonko's trial opened on May 16th but was immediately adjourned until May 23rd after he failed to attend, saying he feared for his safety. Sonko had said he would not appear in court without state guarantees for his personal safety. Sonko is believed to be in the southern city of Zinguicha, several hundred kilometers miles from Dakar where he is mayor. If convicted, Sonko risks being ineligible to run. Sonko, president of the Pasteur for Patriots Party, came in third in the 2019 election against incumbent President Macky Sall. Thank you so much for watching. Peace.